Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a journal flip through. These are all the journals I've completed in my lifetime. Obviously, when I was little, like seven, I did write in a diary. I did own one, but I never really like kept it consistent and I never kept it. You're going to see like how my style of writing changed, what like, um, how I used to be more creative with things and then I just settled down like I mentioned in my last video so let's get started so this is my first journal well not like the first journal ever but this is like when I was older like when I started getting into high school this was my first journal that I well, I wrote in a lot of these journals aren't completed I have like three or four journals that I like started writing in and then like I stopped and I just like wanted a fresh start in this journal, okay, you can see that this journal is pretty thick, but I only wrote like in three pages and that's it. So this was obviously before high school started. This was like the end of eighth grade, the beginning of high school. And I mostly just wrote like what I wanted my life to be like in the future. If you can see here, I wrote like my life and I just like wrote everything that I wanted to do. I was talking about how I wanted to be an actress. Wait, really? How I wanted to be an actress and how it's going to be crazy because of all the paparazzis in LA and I just thought it was going to be super famous. I just did a lot of like planning in this when I was like towards the end of 8th grade. Like I wrote down what I wanted to do in college, what career I wanted, names I wanted for a son and a, or a daughter. You can see here I wrote a list of names here even for a dog. So for girl names I had Rachel. Megan, Marnie, I got Marnie from Halloween Town, Deborah. I don't know if I would pick that name. I saw this scary movie and the main girl, the one that was being getting an exorcism, her name was Deborah. so no thanks. I have Kaya, Layla, Nora, Nora Gray, that's from my favorite book, Hush Hush, Scarlet, that's pretty. For a dog, I have Cedric, I don't think I never ever name my dog Cedric Shaggy boy names I have Jason James Chase I like Chase um Brady I don't think so Noah Colton oh yes half of these names I got from like books like where I read Wattpad so like I get all of my names my stories I have Colton I have Scott I like that patch patch I put here I wanted to name my future son patch that was from a book that I was obsessed with and that's why. Dimitri, that was also from the same book. Xavier. Okay, here I was talking about some boy that I started liking. Goals for high school is to get straight A's. That didn't happen. So I literally just like filled in four pages and the rest is just blank. I want to get back into this because this is a beautiful journal. So moving on to the next journal. This was my second journal. I started off my journal as like a notebook for school. So also I have like math notes. I also started putting in a bunch of quotes. So this, I started wanting a journal a lot in, this was the summer going into 10th grade, I think. So as you can see here, I just like filled it up with random stuff. I have little googly eyes. I have little, I was just, I loved color. And I put in quotes and hearts. I'm obviously not gonna go through every page. This is, ugh, I love this. This is how I got into journaling. Doing that, putting in pictures and then like writing out and made like bold letters pop out by like writing them in like a different color. So that was cool. This, <laughs> I wrote this as what I wanted my body to be like. I love fries. Oh, this is where I wanted to be working. I'm on Broadway. I don't really want to be an actress anymore. I was obsessed with that. Here I was obsessed with Dead Mouse for some reason. I drew this. I got this. I got a picture online and like I drew it out and I painted it and did exactly like that. I put in pictures because I love like rings and stuff and I love black nails with rings, short nails. Um, I have wolves. I was obsessed with wolves. I still love wolves. Here I was obsessed with, what's his name? Gerard Butler because after watching Phantom of the Opera, I just thought he was super hot. And then I was also obsessed with Leonardo DiCaprio, but who isn't? Oh, here I have a family trip. I don't know why I just wrote that. 
and it's just super colorful and fun i love that i was really into it i'm glad see i just pasted a whole bunch of i just did random things kind of nice that look props to me that is super colorful okay this is gonna be a long video if i keep going through every single so this journal was more like pasting a bunch of quotes and just writing about it oh um, i pasted this flower because this boy gave it to me this is a time of the year where i was taught where i would like journal a lot about boys and how much i hated high school but like i started to burn my pages because i just really liked that look that distressed look burning on to the next journal that ended in like 2000 i was like sep september 2015 this is my next journal i picked this journal up at walmart yes i did yeah i did i picked it up at walmart it was a really good journal but as you can see here it started to uh come off <laughs> okay so i see this journal was i didn't really do anything creative it was all just writing oh i just think it stay it was all writing you can see that okay i'm gonna have to put this down but it was all just writing this was the time i think this was sophomore year this was the time I started to get, like, I was just, like, dealing with, why isn't this focusing? Thank you. Um, this is the time I started dealing with some issues, and so I just started to write a lot of my problems down. So I would write a ton of, like, questions, um, talking about my dreams, like, what I dreamt about, um, question, just random questions, but it was all just writing. But this is also the year I found out about American, American Horror Story. Story. I was writing the sexiest guys on American Horror Story top down. We have Edward Mordrick, heck yeah. We have Dandy Mott, always. And we have Evan Peters. I was obsessed. After season one, I was obsessed with psycho boys. Things you wouldn't tell people about yourself. Nope, not going through that. Um, so that's all I have for my journal flip through. Um, maybe in another video I will read some of the cringy things I have in my journals. But um, this was a really fun video to make. If you liked it, make sure to leave a like and make sure to subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.